Wednesday's devotion for January 26th is found in the Upper Room Discipline, written by John Gooch. And our scripture reading this morning is Psalm 71, 1 to 6. In you, O Lord, I take refuge. Let me never be put to shame. In your righteousness, deliver me and rescue me. Incline your ear to me and save me. Be to me a rock of refuge, a strong fortress to save me, for you are my rock and my fortress. Rescue me, O my God, from the hand of the wicked, from the grasp of the unjust and the cruel, for you, O Lord, are my hope. My trust, O Lord, is from my youth. Upon you I have learned from my birth. It was you who took me from my mother's womb, and my praise is continually of you. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. As this author writes this devotion in the summer of 2020, the COVID-19 pandemic is at its height. People are getting sick, people are dying, people are losing their jobs. The economy is going into the tank, and above all, people are afraid. We all stay in our homes, hunkered down, wearing masks if we go out for groceries, trips to the pharmacy, or to see the doctor. Some people are angry because of closures. You remember those times. They may have become better after he wrote, write this, wrote this, or they may have become worse. Either way, they left their mark on you. So you can understand the psalmist when he pleads with God for help. Deliver me, the psalmist says. Rescue me. Save me. That's the way we felt too. Help me, God. Deliver us from this pandemic. Don't let me lose my job. Keep my family safe. Life is sometimes not the best for either the psalmist or us. But notice one thing. The psalmist never gives up on God. The psalmist begins, the psalm begins by saying, In you, O Lord, I take refuge. God is the rock and fortress on whom the psalmist builds his life. God is the source of his hope. And like Job, he cries out to God for help, but never doubts God. From the time of his birth, he has learned to lean on God. These were words of hope as the author began writing in the middle of a pandemic. God is faithful. God is the source of our hope. God doesn't always answer our prayers the way we want, but God is always present for us. In times of fear, when hope seems absent, when life is not good to us, God sustains us. Let us pray. Oh God, teach us always to trust in you. Amen. Blessings.